This is too far. Look who's back. Hi. Oh, that was a great intro. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, he's caught another. up. <laughs> he's caught up on the episodes. Uh, he knows what's happened. Everything. Good night, uh, ambiguous triangle head at the foot of my bed. <laughs> and that's, that's the only scene May. he saw. He didn't see any other episode. No, he just said man. that so he can make it look like he saw them. No. Yeah. Uh, he, no. He actually, I will say this. Catching up on it. Yeah, it's really a tight race between Pearl and Peridot as my favorite characters, which is she funny because they really don't get along. Likeable, yeah. yeah, no, Peridot, <laughs> just amazing. Um, yeah, that's... And then, yeah, so we have another yeah, one. Yeah, and, the and, uh, and Doug's already talked about it, but all the updates with the plot, with... Uh, the cluster. The cluster and build, and the, the drill, which now they're going to be building, but and Steven being useful to Peridot. Yes. That's... Uh, that's Really, I got nothing, because you talked about it already. So. <laughs> okay, let's talk about this episode. Uh, this is one that focuses now on one uh, connection we haven't seen yet between Peridot and uh, Amethyst, where uh, Peridot's discovering uh, humor and goes too far with it and hurts Amethyst's feelings. And she's, as you can probably imagine, she's understanding emotions more, which, you know, on top of being the enemy, uh, you know, we've established that gems and feelings, you know, are kind of strange and, you know, socially a little awkward and stuff, at least compared to humans. Uh, so it, it kind of makes sense that this would happen. And uh, once again, she finds a way to sort of say she's sorry and she wants to form a friendship and stuff, but through the Peridot way, through, like, recording and saying it, but she can't actually say it herself. Um, <laughs> Which basically said, yes, it turns out they all suck. But I guess I suck too, so, you know. <laughs> One of the... What I was saying before uh, talking about this is that, you know, these episodes with Peridot, they seem cliché, like we've seen this a million times, but they're the clichés I like. And it's kind of the same thing here with, like, the way you have this, you know, she's supposed to be, like, this supervillain and everything, but a harnessed will, like, restrain her and stop her, and she can't, like, you know, and she's, like, a little kid, you know, just trying to get it off and whining and complaining. Uh, and I, I, I love those That was right, Barry. It was like, her comments made me feel uncomfortable. <laughs> so they just tether her to a post. Well, and I like how, again, she's so good at isolating everybody, and then, like, the one she seems to have, like, the most, uh, seemingly the most connection with... She hurts the most, you know, without even realizing it. And, and let's let's also add fusiophobic. Yes, she's got some fusiophobia going. Real fusiophobia, right yeah. there. Um, she's like, the two together, I just you know, it I, violates God's law. <laughs> well, that, well, that's what I love about you know the prejudice in general is that when you try to rationalize, rationalize it like intelligently, like you can't, you yeah. know, and it's just it just comes down to basic, you know, come on, you know, you, you can't rationalize it. Um, so yeah, the the one, I mean, it's a good episode. It's kind of. Uh, I don't want to say by the numbers. I like the fact that the space happen, but... travel sign is still on that barn. Yeah. That was a nice callback. Um, and uh, I kind of... It was a bit uncomfortable, but in a good way. I felt like, you know, when she's sort of like just constantly sort of ripping into Amethyst, I'm like... Well, her sense of humor gonna... is like Trump's. It's not so much funny because it's funny. It's just, wow, an asshole actually said that. Yeah. <laughs> it just comes off like, ugh. So um, <laughs> her but... sense of humor definitely needs work. But uh, but you see that she actually is not any more out of necessity. She legitimately feels bad for hurting somebody now. Um, and, you know, she is forming more and more of a connection. Uh, Unlike Trump. Yes. <laughs> Though they have the same kind of hair. Like, if you take that <laughs> That's <triangle>. true. <laughs> like, um, but, uh, yeah, it's a, uh, I mean, it's a good episode. The one thing that I'm a little curious about is uh, I wouldn't be, a, except for this one joke where she's on top of Amethyst, and it's just like, oh, that was an accident. It's like, oh, it's okay, You the drill was no problem. Oh, yes, that too. And it's like, I wonder if they're setting up like some kind of crush or relationship or something like Bout that. Bout Chicken Wow I mean, it, well, we already have plenty Bout Chicken Wow on this. Um, but, yeah. It's Actually, it's mostly things. Chicky Chicky Wow <laughs> That's true. Chicky Chicky Wow Wow. <laughs> Um, well, this could be more Cheeky Cheeky Wow Wow. I don't know. Or maybe it's just uh, like, yeah. maybe it was just a joke and maybe it's just a friendship, you know, I, I don't said, know. I said, oh, yeah. <laughs> I think because this, um, because this race, you know, doesn't seem to have male gems, you know, it's kind of like anything is, you know, kind of off limits. There's even more possibility of, like, characters falling in love with other well, characters. Well, now we're finding out apparently um, it's just like, well, Amethyst is the only real gem, even. Well, because, no, well, because the... Because Pearl's a Pearl, and 
Garnet's effusion. And well, that's still two gems. Again, I think she's going by prejudice, you know, matters. Fusion um, fallback! But, but even then, there's something wrong with Amazon. Well, that's, I'm realizing more and more, and that's, I didn't put that together in the last one. All of them have their own kind of outcast settings, don't they? Because Amethyst is too small, she's not the right size. Pearl is not technically a gem, she's supposed to be a servant, and, uh... Well, when we've seen some Garnet of the other is a gems... Fusion. Yeah, well, then, when I'm thinking about it, when we've seen some of the other gems, they seem rather large. Yeah, you can kind of see why um, they're well, the outcast. Well, the, the, there was the one they went up against that was a good size, like intimidating size. Rose is big. The, the um, water one, uh, Lapis, was that her name? I forget. Yeah, uh, La she, She's not that big. Yeah, she's she might be the, the odd one out. Yeah, but, maybe it's different sizes. But, but I guess it depends, too, if there's different kind of, like, races within the... Because, mm -hmm. like, Amethyst is supposed to be a soldier. Mm -hmm. So maybe they were created, bred, whatever, to be larger. But, yeah, we have seen some pretty good-sized gems. And I do, when I look at those three, kind of be like, I mean, Garnet's the biggest, but she's a but even then, that's, yeah, it's two small yeah. ones coming together. So I'm kind of wondering, but then again, what the fuck is Peridot? Uh, a Malachite. But I don't know what that means, necessarily. Oh, okay. We haven't seen another Malachite, so I don't know. Did they, um, did you look that up, or did they say it? I think they said it. Uh, I forgot when they said, there's so many episodes of it. No, 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 what am I talking about? Peridot, that is actually what the name of the gen is, gem is, so Peridot. Oh, is it? That's yeah. what I was not aware of. Yeah, I, I totally forgot about that. I thought it was that. just some goofy name. Okay, cool. No, Ma Malachite, that's right. I with someone never... else. That's the new uh, mutation or whatever. I'm I sorry. Have, I have never heard of that. Uh, I I'm going to look, I'm actually... have to look that one up. Uh, no, it, Most, it's, it's like, green... pretty much all the other ones I knew. I, I have not. Yeah, it, it, huh. it's a green stone. Um, well, you learn something new every day. Thanks, Steven Universe! <laughs> well, no, I always thought it was a play on Paradox, you know. That's what I thought. Like, yeah. you know, something with a I thought. See, I thought initially she wasn't even a gem of some sort. She was some robot thing. But, of mm -hmm. course, they took the robot, you know, are the, the uh, what would she call them in that episode I caught up on? The, the limb enhancers? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, I love, by the way, in that episode, they just dump it, just like, whoops! <laughs> wow, douchebags. <laughs> my, my favorite is still uh, Scent sponge the the different names for everything was great and then oh, what's Gra this that's your butt i mean gravity that's, that's a perfectly gravity joke. connectors yeah good i too. mean those are great terms those are so funny and then to end on you know that's your butt i mean that's that's a perfectly told joke i'd kill I mean, if this whole perfect. time though this was one big scam and paradox really gonna like blow up the planet by creating this drill and stuff just you know that seems them. unlikely, or at I know. least if she's going to, I, she's going to have one of those things where she comes back. No, just... Yeah, where it's like, that was her original plan, but no, she can't. She's formed too strong a friendship. Um, oh no, ultimate betrayal. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, Curse your inevitable betrayal. <laughs> so, um, yeah, good episode. Anything else uh, you got out? No, I... I just found it enjoyable. Yeah. So. I, anything with I'm kind of with you. Paradox becoming I, one of my Paradon favorite and Pearl characters. are my favorites, personally. But um, yeah, no, she's. I'm a Pearl that. girl. Somebody sent me <laughs> somebody an image did of that. Send, uh, like, I'm gonna have to make a T-shirt out of that. Yeah. No, somebody actually did. Actually, there were a couple uh, of people that put together like a Pearl girl um, shirt design. Uh, so good job. Uh, and I got, good God, I got so many gifts because I said the gif of, or the image of Peridot spinning in the toilet, like somebody make a gif of that, they have it, and like, so many people send me gifts of that, so thank you, great, I, I got plenty, <laughs> uh, I thought it was very funny, um, so, yeah, that's about it, we will see you on the next one, later.